here we have a sad math question on exponents. So let's go to the question. If a plus b equals to 8 and 27 to the 8th power over uh, 3 to the b power equals to 81, what is the value of a? Okay, there is an equation which contains uh, a and b. Okay, I think we may have to contain another equation over here uh, using this, uh, this one, 27 to the power a divided by 3 to the power b equals to 81. So for that, what we need to do is, uh, actually we have to get the second equation in terms of a and b, but a and b are in exponent. So whenever uh, we are uh, trying to solve for uh, some stuff which is at the exponent, so we should be trying to get the same base on both sides. So that we'll be able to equal the exponents and uh, we can solve for uh, the variable for which we need the value. Okay, anyway, so when I look at uh, this 27, this 3, 81, all of them are powers of 3. Okay, now uh, let me take this equation 27 to the power a over uh, 3 to the power b equals to 81. Since 27, 3, 81, all of them are powers of 3, we can write 27 as a power of 3, that is 3 to the third power uh, whole to the power a. And we have nothing to do with this 3, already it's just 3, it's a prime number. And 81 can be written as a power of 3, that is 3 to the fourth power. Okay, using the power of a power rule in exponent, we can multiply the two exponents over here. Then I'll be getting 3 to the power 3a over 3 to the power b equals to 3 to the fourth power. So here we divide two terms at the same base. Whenever I divide two terms at the same base, what I can do is I can take the base once and I have to subtract the exponents. So I'll be getting 3a negative b equals to 3 to the fourth power. Here, uh, two terms are equal with the same base on both sides. So what we can do is we can equate the exponents. When I equate the exponents, I'll be getting uh, 3a negative b equals to 4. Okay, already there is an equation uh, in the question that is a positive b equals to 8. So I think we can uh, add the given equation and the equation what we got. Then uh, positive b negative b will cancel, uh, will, will cancel out and uh, we'll be able to get the value of a. Okay, let me take the given equation a positive b equals to 8. Now I'm going to add the two equations. So negative b positive will cancel. I get 4a equals to 8 positive 4 is 12. Then uh, to solve for a, I divide both sides by 4. This 4, 4 will cancel. 4 goes into 4 one times. 4 goes into 12 thrice. So I get a equals to 3. So the correct answer choice for this question is option a.